The Latter Days, Season 9, Episode 23, Part 2. Welcome back to the celebratory show. Kiernan has shown us half of his documentary about the hidden truth of his family genetics and how it leads to Josh and Ella's dictatorship. Kiernan, please tell us the other half of this indulging story. Thank you. Okay, Part 2. Here we are. Rosie and Elisha were both in Fort Grimm as part of Linda and Lydia's plot to gain control over them. This is where Rosie met Scott, whom Linda brought over from South Africa for her beginning plans for human testing for plastic surgery. Vicky, Kiernan and Jade made the plan to get Rosie, Elisha and Scott out of jail. With the help of Dr. Hunk. Hunk and Vicky made their own plans to get Rosie, Elisha and Scott out. Hunk sent Mr. Drake, an inspector round and he closed the prison. Linda and Lydia got sent to jail. Linda was sentenced for life. Lydia was sentenced for 21 years. Unfortunately, in this process, Vicky, Dr. Hunk and Mr. Drake were murdered. 20 years on, Rosie and Scott split up, but previously had a daughter called Valentina. Valentina went to university to get herself into politics. In the meantime, Linda had just passed away. Julia, Linda's second eldest, wanted revenge on Rosie and justice for Lydia. Lydia had one more year left in prison and Julia appealed the last year and won. Lydia stayed out of trouble and moved on. Julia got closer to Rosie. Kiernan opened his show Ugly Fuckers. Rosie appeared on Kiernan's show to give her a heart transplant. However, Julia swapped the healthy heart with a really fatty, disgusting heart. Rosie woke up feeling worse. As Julia got closer to Rosie, she managed to get Rosie doing all the wrong things like exercise and eating bad foods in hopes to kill her. The whole plan on Rosie backfired on Julia. Julia organized a fun run for Rosie. Rosie made her participate and Julia died in the process. All was then revealed and Rosie got a second heart transplant, but with positive outcomes. Then look who appears out of nowhere. Mac. Kiernan's brother. He muscled in, in everyone's lives and had an obsession with body parts. He eventually reopened Linda's old surgery and got together with Miss Green. They went on to have twins, Josh and Ella. Mac went to prison for his organ obsession and Miss Green left to go to the Arctic. Josh and Ella were adopted by Kozak and Vanessa. Josh and Ella joined a politics course at university. Constance picked them out and wanted them as her personal assistants. Josh and Ella plotted to overthrow Constance. They pulled strings over her. She then eventually died due to Rosie having to kill her. Josh and Ella were so evil, they broke up Kozak and Vanessa, became the dictators, lied to the public about who were the threats to society when they were. Kiernan called back the last hope. Lydia. Lydia made it up to us by killing Josh and Ella. They wanted to know all about Linda's old practices. After Josh and Ella died, a new leader stepped in. A good leader. Wow. What an incredible story. What a way to end your TV career. Everyone please give a round of applause for Kiernan. The best TV star in the world. Thank you everyone. Thank you. It's now time to say farewell. Thank you for all your love and support over the years. Goodbye. <laughs>